It is not just about performance on standardized tests. It is a balanced indicator system that includes recognition of graduation rates and AP exams and industry credentials and SAT scores. All of it goes into looking at a school's performance and a district's performance. And it is very balanced when you think about the work that happens in a Texas public school. Part of the rating is based upon student achievement. This is what they know and they can do at the end of the year. And this is very important because we are working to get our kids to be prepared to, to live and succeed in the American dream, to, to produce. And when you go apply for a job, they're gonna to wanna to know what can you do for me? And so we look at exactly what the kids know and can do. But education is more than just that. We, we are an institution that focuses on growth. We take three, four, five-year-old bundles of energy and we turn them into best versions of themselves, into self-aware members of the republic over the course of 15 years. We try to maximize human potential. And so the, the accountability system also looks at school progress, the amount of growth that our students have made and we have made in support of our students. And we don't look at just all students in general. We also look um, at, at performance by focusing on how we're closing the gaps. We look at each group of kids because the American dream is for everyone. We, we want you to learn and achieve at high levels. And we don't mean unless you are a foster child. We don't mean unless you are homeless. We don't mean unless you are poor. We don't mean unless you are in special education. We don't mean unless you come from a household that doesn't speak English. We don't mean unless you're black or you're brown or you're whatever. We mean every child will learn and achieve at high levels. And we will start here close to home at Brandenburg Elementary in Irving ISD. We take a look at Brandenburg Elementary and we can see how well did this school perform? How did it, did it jump from the 78 to a 90? Because this is not about where we are today by itself. It is about the journey that we are on. We do not live in a utopia. This is about continuous Im improvement and support of students. Because what we want is next week, the work that we do for students to be better than this week. And this week, the work is better than last week. It is about constantly stepping up our game and making sure that we make public education, the reality of public education, the equivalent to the promise, so that all of our kids, no matter what their zip code, that they all have access to a rigorous educational opportunity. And so, again, all of this information is made available and transparently available to everyone. And we try to make this as um, easy to understand as possible. So, for example, if you want to know how this system works, you click on Tell Me More. And you can see very easily infographics and explanatory text that says exactly how this system works. Nothing is hidden from you. It is, we've maximized transparency for, for everyone involved. And you can look at overall performance, or you can dig, dig deeper into the information um, if you're interested. So if we want to take a look, for example, at how well Brandenburg has been closing the gaps, we click on additional details, and we can see that there's a balanced set of indicators that are looked at in terms of how we're closing the gaps. And, and you can see exactly how that breaks down for each group of kids, because we have goals for each one of our kids that we want to meet, and we can d discern whether we're meeting those goals or missing those goals. And from this, we build action plans to better support our kids. All of this is available uh, you can pull it up on your phone right now, techschools.gov, uh, and, and see this for every campus.